Have you ever seen a plant-based influencer or doctor and wondered, wait, why do they look older than they are? I say that with respect because for eight years, I was one of them. I was vegetarian, even dipped into veganism. I thought I was doing everything right. But over time, I noticed something wasn't adding up, not just in me, but in others too. People aging faster, losing strength, energy, and even mental sharpness. So today, I want to share the seven real reasons why that happens. And if you're on a plant-based path or considering one, this may be one of the most important videos you'll watch. Let me be honest, back when I was plant-based, that decision was not based on ethics. I went plant-based because of Google. One search for how to eat healthy turned into a whirlwind of plant-based blogs, green smoothie recipes, and inspiring but one-sided documentaries like forks over knives. Once you find one influencer, the algorithm leads you to 10 more. And before you know it, you're deep in the leafy jungle. And for a while, it felt good. I dropped processed food. I cooked more. I felt lighter. But then things started to shift. I was often tired, my workouts didn't feel as strong, I had lingering inflammation, and my irritable bowel only got slightly better. And I started to ask myself, could my healthy diet be missing something vital? Spoiler alert, yes. So let's dive into what I and many others were missing. Let's break down what your body actually needs to stay youthful, strong, and sharp as you age, and why plant-based diets often fall short unless you're extremely intentional. Number one, muscle loss. Do to low leucine and incomplete proteins. Muscle isn't just vanity. It's a vital sign of longevity. But plant-based proteins are typically incomplete, lacking one or more essential amino acids. They also contain less leucine, which is key for activating mTOR, the cellular pathway that tells your body to build and preserve muscle. Without enough leucine, especially as you age, you're at risk for sarcopenia, that slow, silent loss of muscle that leads to fragility, falls, and insulin resistance. Animal proteins like beef, eggs, and fish are leucine rich and complete, making muscle preservation much more efficient. Number two, bone loss due to poor calcium absorption without K2. You've probably heard calcium is important for bones, but without vitamin K2, calcium can end up in your arteries instead. K2 acts like a GPS. It directs calcium into your bones and away from soft tissue. But here's the catch. It's virtually absent in plant-based diets unless you're eating fermented natto daily, and most people aren't. Animal-based sources like egg yolks, liver, butter, and aged cheese naturally contain K2. Without it, you're at higher risk of osteopenia, fractures, and even arterial calcification as you age. Number three, B12 deficiency, leading to nerve damage and high homocysteine. Vitamin B12 is found only in animal based foods. And without it, your body can't form healthy red blood cells, maintain nerve sheaths, or keep homocysteines at the right level. A dangerous marker for heart and brain disease in check. Over time, low B12 leads to brain fog, memory loss, balance issues, tingling and numbness in hands and feet. And if you carry an MTHFR gene mutation, you may struggle even more with methylation, meaning your risk for high homocysteine skyrockets. B12 is essential, full stop. Number four, omega-3 deficiency leading to brain shrinkage and depression. Plant-based diets do provide ALA, alpha linoleic acid, but your body must convert that into EPA and DHA, the long chain omega-3s that build your brain retina and cell membrane. Conversion rate, often under 5%, especially in men, and lower in people with insulin resistance or inflammation. Without DHA, your brain shrinks faster, your mood worsens, your cognitive function declines, and your risk for neurodegeneration rises. Animal-based DHA from things like fish, eggs, and meat is immediately usable. No conversion required. Number five, zinc deficiency. This can lead to weak immunity, skin issues, or low testosterone. Zinc is a powerhouse for many things like your immune health, testosterone production, wound healing, skin integrity, and DNA repair. But here's the problem. Phytates, which are naturally found in grains, legumes, and seeds, bind to zinc and prevent its absorption. And with meat off the plate, 
most plant-based eaters simply don't get enough. Low zinc can show up as frequent infections, skin rashes or acne, low libido, delayed healing. It's a deficiency that whispers until it screams. Number six, iron deficiency, leading to anemia, fatigue, and cold sensitivity. Plants contain non-heme iron, which is poorly absorbed and easily blocked by phytates and oxalates. Animal-based heme iron from things like liver, beef, or lamb is much more bioavailable. Many plant-based patients, especially women, experience fatigue, pale skin, brittle nails, shortness of breath, cold extremities. Even when iron levels look normal, they may be functionally low. And that puts stress on everything from your thyroid to your brain. Number seven, retinol deficiency, leading to skin, eyes, and immune breakdown. You may think carrots and sweet potatoes provide vitamin A, but that's beta carotene a precursor. Your body must convert it into retinol, the active form, which is used for night vision, skin repair, mucosal immunity, reproductive health. But the conversion isn't efficient and gets worse with age, thyroid dysfunction, gut issues, or genetic variants. Only animal foods like liver, eggs, and dairy contain ready-to-use retinol. Without it, you may notice things like dry eyes, dull skin, frequent colds, and slower wound healing. Now to be fair, plant-based often feels amazing at first. You've removed the ultra-processed junk. You're eating more fiber. You feel lighter, more energetic, and even clearer. But most of the early wins come from elimination, not from plant power. And as the months and years pass, those missing pieces start catching up. Brain fog, hormonal imbalances, sarcopenia, bone loss, deficiency-driven depression or anxiety. And most people don't realize what's wrong because it happens slowly. That's why I say you need a degree in nutrition to pull off plant-based long-term without consequences. In my clinic on the south side of Chicago, I don't have the luxury of suggesting diets that require 15 supplements and a spreadsheet. I recommend animal-based diets not because they're trendy, but because they're nutrient-dense, efficient, and self-correcting for most deficiencies, especially in communities with limited access to high-quality whole foods, or proper lab testing. Eating meat and eggs is often the safest path to long-term health. You don't need to be a full carnivore like myself, but you do need to get the essential nutrients your body was designed to run on. So let's recap. You don't age because the clock keeps ticking. You age because your cells stop repairing and they stop repairing when they don't have what they need. So here are the seven most common deficiencies that plant-based diets often create. Number one, leucine for muscle. Number two, K2 for bone. Number three, B12 for nerves. Number four, DHA for brain. Number five, zinc for immunity. Number six, iron for oxygen. And number seven, retinol for skin and vision. If you're on a plant-based diet and thriving, amazing. But if you're struggling, maybe your body's whispering for something it's missing. You can test, you can supplement, or you can simply reintroduce the nutrient-dense foods your body has always known. And if this video hit home, share it or drop a comment. What's your experience with plant-based or animal-based eating? And don't miss the next video on the screen right here. Or even better, subscribe to my YouTube channel right here. You're just a click away from more learning and healing. I am humbled that you've come to my channel. And remember, real food equals real healing.